Hello, Sam Owens here, and uh, we're going to look at the iPhone 15 and the control center that is uh, on your phone. Now, you don't uh, see the, uh, the control center anywhere on the screen view or as an app or anything. It's under settings, but it is uh, accessible very quickly with a swipe down and it, from the upper right hand corner. Now we're going to try that. I go up here and just swipe down like that. There is the view of the control center. Now the control center could be very helpful uh, to quickly access features of the phone that you don't have to go into settings and find them or find the app for them. You can, uh, you get a default setting of a certain number of them and uh, they uh, live on this control center. And you have three default pages here. This is recent. This is all the stuff that I had actually uh, clicked on to learn it. Then you have your player which is right here, that music symbol. Oh, I've got to actually go to the phone <clears throat> right here. That is your player. Whatever you have playing uh, or music or video, it will play here. And also you have all of your connectivity uh, settings. Now these are helpful for like uh, Wi-Fi. If you want to turn it off, it's on right now. You just click and then it says not connected. And you turn it back on. If you're getting on an airplane, you can quickly click there and you're in airplane mode. Okay, same way another helpful one is Bluetooth. Sometimes you're trying to pair another device uh, and you don't want your uh, your smartphone to try to connect you can turn Bluetooth off for your smartphone real quick and then if you want to connect to one of the devices real quick if you click down below you see you can do that and then you click back here and it goes back right here see you can just click that and then that's how you get back out of it Personal hotspot. I've already created a video on how to set up the uh, personal hotspot. And so this is a page that works real well with it. Let's uh, look at one other feature. You know, you have to use two fingers to shut your phone off if you wanted to in a quick hurry. Well, uh, this is a sequence that you can go. Just get out of this. Now, if you're in a situation where I need to shut the phone off real quick, just go there, hold it, and then swipe, and you're off. Now we're back. Now what I want to do is show you how you can add uh, features to your control center. And let's go back to the control center. And now up here is a positive sign. You just press on that. And notice you have an, uh, a, a few things that happen right away, but down at the bottom, add uh, a control. So you can add a control, but before we do, if you want to delete anything on this page that you say uh, is crowded and I don't need it, then you click the minus sign and it will go away. Now you can re-add it later if you want. Uh, like uh, here's your sound bar. And you can do this. You can change, and you always go back. Let's say you want to change the size of it, like there. See, you get a little symbol. Anywhere where they've got a little symbol like this, you can pull it like that. Whoop, and you can move it. But let's try this. Whoop there I made it bigger now I can go back and make it smaller and go back to around okay so you can edit you can move and now let's go back to add a control so I click here and now I can go if I wanted an alarm I can do it uh, we've already got a screen recording that's a good one let's click that 
and now screen recording is right there that allows you to record anything that's on your screen like you're shopping you can go back and look at that and uh, you have uh, information about what you were shopping for so especially if you're searching you can turn uh, this uh, screen recording on and it would be good uh, okay now to get out of this when you're finished adding then you can click and you're back out now you have to come back in like that and let's go down here there okay so that's pretty much how it works and it's uh, very helpful let's see if there's anything else there and then to add now let's go on down there's a lot of stuff uh, capture stuff camera it's already on there scan code some of this is already Instagram you could add that you can add a timer or stopwatch all your connectivity is there display a lot of that is is uh, uh, displayed and going on down oh if you wanted a level you could do it so you'll click there and there's your level now to get out of this uh, mode you just click anywhere down and now you're back now let's see what uh, that looks like the level and there's your level and if you move this around you see how you can it's not level here there okay and it turns green so there's a level and we will get out of it just by clicking and then swing and we're out and now we're back so the control center could be very helpful uh, to quickly access features that you need real quick so you just review them and see it's there and uh, it lives behind that swipe so to get out just click and you're back normal anytime you want to see the control center remember there now I'll show you the control center also is under the settings button and if you wanted you could to find it oh right there is the control center and there you go and it's telling you a little bit about uh, how to operate it and if you wanted to reset it back to the default you always have reset control center so there you go and okay i hope this is very helpful for you and i want to thank you very much for watching my video